Hey everyone, this is Angel. Um, I haven't done a video in a while, but I wanted to make one today. I am a little bit more than 35 weeks pregnant, so I will be having another baby soon. So that kind of led me to decide what my topic will be today. And it's just really simple and pretty short. It's just how exactly to have a fit pregnancy. Um, so many people have asked me, you know, how have you, how have you stayed active? How do you have the energy to do what you do? One simple answer, I stay active. <laughs> um, there's really, there's no magic formula. It's if you want energy during your pregnancy, you, there's really three things that you can do primarily. Get enough sleep, exercise. I recommend 30 minutes, three to five days a week. Um, if, and you know, honestly, that's if you were an exerciser before you got pregnant. Don't take on this super vigorous routine, or rigorous routine. Um, if you did absolutely no exercise before you're pregnant, listen to your body, but become active. Um, even if it's just going for a walk, it'll, it'll raise your energy so much. And three, um, supply your body with nutrients. Don't eat the crap that your little womb share is telling you to eat. It's, it's not smart. It's not good for you. It's not good for the baby. And it's not going to give you the energy that you need, especially if you have a toddler like I do, because he is pretty darn active. And I... I don't even know how I would have had any energy with this pregnancy had I not been eating healthy, exercising, um, getting enough sleep, and of course drinking my Shakeology every day, every single day. Um, you know, things change a little bit as your pregnancy progresses. Even it, it changes tremendously from your first trimester to your third. Um, my first trimester with this baby, Eleonora, by the way, I, I was wiped out and nauseous 24-7 my first trimester, like the entire thing. <laughs> it was my first, um, it was my first sign of being pregnant was just 24-7 nausea. So I went from exercising six days a week to maybe two to four because I just, I felt like crap. Um, but at the first sign that my nausea was letting up, I got back on my clean eating. I started exercising again. And my energy and my health and how I felt mentally and physically skyrocketed. Um, I, you know, and this, is, this continued throughout my entire pregnancy. I'm still working out. I have not missed one single day of exercise since I was 21 weeks. That is 14 weeks. How many How many months was that? Over, over three? <laughs> um, and honestly, it's just a half hour a day. It's not that much. Um, but I do, I've done a combination of a 21 day fix, um, which really, it was really great for me. You guys all know that though. And also, hold on, also, um, Les Mills Combat, and Body Beast, and, um, I'm also doing Pio now, too. And I really, I didn't have to modify too much other than not very much ab work during the 21 Day Fix, but... Up until the past two weeks, I've had to mo start modifying a little bit more, and it's because my stomach is gigantic now. <laughs> but um, I've had so many people tell me, you know, I look like a normal person. I don't even look pregnant. And then I turn sideways, and they're like, wow, <laughs> there's a baby in there. <laughs> so, honestly, best thing for you to do while you're pregnant Eat healthy, get enough sleep, exercise, and if you want a fourth extra awesome bonus, drink Shakeology.
Um, it's if you drink the regular formula, you would want to um, split your prenatal in thirds so that you're not getting too much vitamin A. And if you drink the vegan, you're fine. You can drink a whole serving and um, take your entire prenatal. So that's my spiel. I plan to continue on exercising every single day until I cannot do it anymore, i.e. I am giving birth. <laughs> and you, you guys will see how it goes. Um, it's probably going to drive me absolutely nuts not being able to exercise after having her, but at the same time, I will definitely have my hands full, so I'm not too worried about it, and I will get back into it as soon as humanly possible, you know, being cleared by my doctor and everything. So, that's it. Um, you have any questions? I am so happy to help any mom-to-be or mom or regular person. You don't have to be pregnant. You don't even have to be a female. I am happy to help you on your health journey. So just send me a friend request, facebook.com slash Angelina R. Stutzko. And um, follow my YouTube, follow my Instagram, Angelina R. Stutzko. Um, Pinterest is Angel Stutzko. Uh, Twitter is Angeline Stutzko, but I don't really use a, that all that much. But anyways, that's it. Um, I hope this has been sort of informative for you guys. I know I ramble a little bit, but, you know, it's just me. So, have a great day.